WandaVision, Phase 4 of the MCU is finally here with two episodes of WandaVision. I'm just going to keep this up in the background. It's the logo. You're going to be seeing this throughout my reviews. There's nine episodes in total, I believe. Which, actually, here's a fun thing. There's nine episodes in total. And they're being released weekly. With the final episode of WandaVision being released in March. And then let's see, the week after that is apparently the first episode of Falcon and the Winter Soldier. What else could we ask for right there? So WandaVision. The kickoff to Phase 4 of the MCU. We got an excellent little video package at the start of this episode. Now there, there's no titles for these episodes, so it's just episode one, episode two, there's no titles for it. And I loved the opening little package to this. It has Wanda and Vision uh, driving down the street. There's a postman who waves at them. It's all done in like a 50s slash 60s style. Vision has to hide his face because he's obviously a robot. He walks through the door, drops Wanda, because that's fun. <laughs> they buy a house. They are obviously married, because Wanda's in a wedding dress. And the whole purpose of this episode is there's a little heart on the door. Or on the calendar, and they don't know what that's for. Vision then goes to work. Vision's got a job. And Wanda says to him, right, no, change your face. So he has to go into his human form, which we have seen in Avengers Infinity War. We saw the human version of Vision. And we also meet Agatha, I think. Agnes, I think. It's one of those two. It's Agatha or Agnes. We meet her in this episode, and she is Wanda's next-door neighbour. She starts asking all these questions. Oh, what's a single girl like you doing in these parts? And she's like, no, no, I, I am married to a man, a human man. And she convinces Agatha, or this woman, that it is their anniversary. But at Vision's workplace, he works in like this office environment. And he discovers, oh no, that heart was for my boss, Mr. Heart. And him and his wife are coming round for dinner. So now we have two different things. Wanda thinks, oh, we're having an anniversary tonight. But Vision's like, no, no, we, we have uh, this guy and his wife coming round. And then the episode just takes a weird turn and has this commercial for a toaster. They put a product placement in the middle of this episode. But this toaster is actually done by Stark Industries. A nice little shout out to Tony Stark in this, and it's brilliant, the little shout out they gave. And in episode two, which we're doing tomorrow night, um, there's another nice little shout out to the MCU. So Wanda and Vision now, Vision comes home with the boss and his wife. And Wanda makes a fool of herself thinking it's their anniversary and she's wearing this like exposing dress it's like oh my god i'm so sorry um and then they have to explain oh i thought it was the anniversary the boss is here <coughs> this is going to be embarrassing they entitled a list of agatha to help with the food wanda is using her powers throughout this to try and focus on what she's actually doing vision's in having a folk and dance routine um with the boss and then they go and have their dinner, or when they have breakfast. Because Wanda makes like a breakfast meal instead of a dinner. <laughs> but while they're at this dinner, the boss starts asking all these questions. Who are you? Where did you come from? Well, how, how long have you been married? And he starts getting really angry. And he's like, come on, I want answers. What, what, what do you do for a living? And then he starts choking. And the, the wife is laughing for some reason. But then Wanda's like, Vision, help him, help him out. So Vision uses his powers to help him out. Vision then gets promoted. 
gets promoted. Okay, yeah, I like that. And that's pretty much the end of the episode. Wanda then puts rings on their fingers. She can just make rings appear like Sonic. <laughs> just makes a ring appear on their finger. And then the episode ends with a pullout from... Because obviously the whole way through this episode, it's all been in like a 50 size TV. And it pulls out and you see a person watching on the screen. And you see the sword logo. Now, for those of you who have no idea what sword is, it's pretty much like S.H.I.E.L.D., but it's different. It's in the Marvel comics. I won't go into too much detail of it, but if you know S.W.O.R.D., it ties into this entirely. Like, you see it throughout the next episode as well. But guys, that's going to do it for this first episode on WandaVision. Phase 4 has finally kicked off, and... We have two episodes already of WandaVision, like, just the logo alone. I'm in love with the logo, and I'm in love with this series. The first episode definitely got me ready to go, and I literally just, I didn't even hold back. I was like, right, first episode done, let's watch the second, let's go. And the second one, I think, definitely had more little hints towards the MCU and we'll get into that uh, in that episode, which will be tomorrow. I have a video first tomorrow morning. It's just another opening of chests in Disney Magic Kingdom. Nothing too big, but... Uh, and then the review will be tomorrow night. And that's it until next week. We have to wait until next Friday for episode three. But I can guarantee the wait will be worth it. So guys, thank you for watching. Yeah, yeah I'm coming. It's a friendship, Doctor. Twat. Yeah, I'm coming. Thank you for watching. Phase 4 has begun!